McNair Elementary School was established in 2001. The school and the McNair Farms community are situated on what used to be the McNair family farm. In 1904, Warren and Lucy McNair moved from Ohio to Fairfax County. Warren worked for the Patent Office in Ohio, and he occasionally traveled to Washington, D.C. on business trips. While traveling through Fairfax County, he fell in love with the area and decided to return to his farming roots. In the early 1900s, the McNair farm was largely used for raising poultry. The farm had a great deal of forest initially, so the McNairs built a sawmill and used the timber to make lumber for buildings. After the forest was cleared, the McNairs dynamited the tree stumps to prepare the land for farming. The soil was very rocky, so the McNairs used a machine to crush the rocks into gravel, which was then used to pave Centerville Road from Flores to Herndon. With the rock removed, the McNairs went to work plowing the fields by horse and by hand. Warren's son, Wilson McNair, attended school in Flores and went on to learn agriculture and military studies at Virginia Polytechnic Institute. After graduating in 1916, he returned to work the family farm. In 1917, the McNair farm switched from raising poultry to milking dairy cows. Dairy cows do not take holidays, so the McNairs worked seven days a week, 365 days a year. The cows were milked twice a day, once in the morning and again in the evening. The milk had to be kept cold, so the McNairs stored the milk in tall cans set in cold water until it could be taken to the train depot in Herndon by horse and wagon. The farm fields were used to grow corn, wheat, and hay to feed the cows. During the 1920s and 30s, the McNair farm gradually mechanized. Tractors replaced horses for plowing, trucks replaced wagons, hay balers replaced hand harvesting, milking machines replaced hand milking, and bulk milk tanks replaced milk cans. After serving in World War II, Wilson's son, Robert McNair, returned to work the family farm. During the 1960s, the dairy cattle herd grew to 45 cows, and by the late 1970s, peaked at some 60 cows. In 1962, Dulles Airport opened, unleashing waves of residential development in western Fairfax County. More and more people moved into Centerville, Herndon, and the new community of Reston. Farmers, unable to pay rising property taxes, sold off their farms to developers. The McNair family farm was sold in 1983 and was developed into suburban homes in the 1990s. Robert McNair's son, Tom McNair, describes the changes to the area. Where we are right now, right, uh, the PNC Bank is right on where Centerville Road and probably right where our farm was. I'm looking at the, uh, uh, I guess the Sunoco station back there, our, our gas station. That's probably about where the farm house was. Uh, right over there and where the American flag is flying right now. As a child, Tom McNair worked on the family farm, helping his father and grandfather. The McNair family was a big proponent of education and many of the family members went on to work as educators in Fairfax County Public Schools. Going up here as a boy, I never thought we'd have a school named after McNair family. And to have a school named after us, I am very proud of that.